Well everyone, this is the Al Dolly video on the Beholder MS1 Stabilizer on how to set up inverted mode. To modify settings on the MS1, you'll need to remove the plastic cap covering the mini USB port located on the back of the gimbal. Remove the two screws with a screwdriver. Next, you will need to download the software Simple BGC version 2.40B7 for 8-bit boards. Also, depending on systems, you'll need to download USB to UART drivers, and for macOS, you'll need the latest version of Java. If you encounter installation or connection issues, check with Google and Basecamp for technical support. Connect the MS1 by the mini USB port to your computer's USB port. Open Simple BGC, and for Mac users, you'll need to launch the .jar file to launch Simple BGC. Select your connection. Your connections may be different. We're right now using Mac OS X. We're going to select USB to UART and hit connect. Now the software is going to read the data that is stored in the MS1 and loaded into Simple BGC's interface. Now before we start changing settings, let's make a backup of the factory settings. Go over to Profile, select Profile 1, Save. We're going to title this Factory Profile 1 and hit save. Now we need to also save profile 3. Profile 2 is unused on the MS1 so we don't need to worry about saving that. So once again save and we're going to title this factory profile 3. Another reason why we are saving these profiles is once data is written to the MS1 all previous data that was stored on that board is lost. Now moving on to the easiest step in this process we want to locate RC settings, locate mid, and change it to inverse yaw. Once that's done, we want to write. And once again, before we do this, make sure you have the profile settings saved. All right, we're gonna hit write. How you access that is by pressing the joystick in as if you would to calibrate the gyros. Instead of calibrating the gyros, it's going to flip the yaw axis, so now the MS-1 can operate in inverted mode and still maintain stability. If you want to get calibrate gyro back, all you have to do is go back to mid, select, calibrate gyro, and write. One issue with having inverse yaw is the MS-1 has now lost the ability to calibrate its gyro. If the gyro needs to be calibrated, a computer will be needed. To calibrate the gyro with the software, go to the Basics tab, locate Calibrate Gyro, and hit Calibrate. Note, only calibrate the MS-1 if the gimbal does not remain level while the motors are active. During the process of calibration, the gimbal must be level and untouched. Any outside vibrations can cause a miscalibration and performance issues. Also, the accelerometers can be calibrated. This calibration follows the same procedures as calibrating the gyro. Only calibrate when the system needs to be calibrated. Looking for more information about the Beholder MS-1? You can find it at aldolly.com.